you know next is much much more than what we are getting here so we need a different approach to create next application for that let's go to the next website and go to get started and here on the installation part we can see we can create next application using create next app but for that you need npx what is npx and for that let's click here and here we have the npx it execute npm package binaries and if you don't have npx either you can upgrade your npm to 5.2.0 or later or you can install npx by using npm install npx very easy thing and then you need to have this kind of uh, uh, command to create your project so why not create our project by using this npx approach and we will see what's the difference between this kind of approach and this kind of approach so for that what i'm going to do i'm going to firstly close this vs code delete this uh, uh, next app folder and then i will create terminal here and i will say npx because i already have npx so if i click npx yeah we have it so npx create next app and my app name is next hyphen app once you hit enter it will ask various questions to set up your next application first your project name if you are not giving anything then it will take your next app so i'm going to say next app and it says description a default description is this if you want to give that's okay otherwise just hit enter then because you know server next uses server side rendering also to have server side rendering we need a server framework so we want to use express and actually we are not touching server side code but let's use express it doesn't matter then it says what are the features you want to have on your next application so yes i want pwa progressive web app i want linting i want prettier axios so we are not going to talk about pwa here maybe we will talk about it later but i am just going to show you how these things are going to work so once you decided what you want then again hit enter then it says what ui framework what uh, framework you want to use there are a bunch of frameworks to choose from but i'm going to use beautify and that's my favorite so hit enter once more and then if you want to test your application then you can use just eva or if you are not going to test just say none so let's use uh, uh, eva okay so, so let's use eva and then most important thing is which kind of application you are going to create is that universal app means the server side rendering and single page application uh, combined or you just want a single page application so let's use universal apps because it is very cool and in that you also get what is single page application so i'm going to use universal application then author name and which package manager you want to use i recommend to have yarn but npm is also very famous so i'm going to use npm but you know sometimes happens you need to have yarn and sometimes things doesn't work with npm so we need to install everything by using yarn so that's why i sometimes use both <laughs> but let's recommend with npm and now it says you cannot uh, no longer contain capital letter so i'm using capital letter here that's why it's uh, saying these kind of things so let's do everything first and express then pwa linting prettier axios then beautify and ever then comes universal yeah okay npm and now it's installing everything for our next application and finally we are having our next app here so i'm going to close this terminal and go into the next and next app open this with vs code so here we have and now you can see we have lots of lots of things here and we will talk about everything in, in the next episode and how you can get started with these kind of structures of next application so let me just show you a quick thing that 
npm run dev will again going to start server at localhost 3000 but this time it is using nodemon and i think last time also it was using nodemon but yeah you can see the dot next directory is here everything is now compiling on client side on server side and that's how you can create your first next app using npx so yes our server is started at localhost 3000 so let's just go to localhost 3000 and this time we are getting this kind of uh, home page or welcome page from the next because now we have chosen next with beautify so this kind of structure we have and if i click on this continue <laughs> yeah you can see some kind of quotation we have and that's how we can start with nuxjs by using npx and in the next episode we are going to talk about the package.json what it include understanding each and everything from this kind of directory structure and if you want to learn more and work on real projects then head over to bitfumes.com slash courses section to have all the courses from Udemy and some of the premium courses just for this website and every video is ad free and hello hi free just pure learning so we will meet in the next episode till then goodbye